This morning we are finishing up Chuck's latest big adventure <laughs> with a one of a kind dining experience in Door County, Wisconsin. And Chuck, I understand you weren't too sure about this one at first. And I have to agree with you. I mean, because the fish boil seems a tad dangerous. Yeah, it does. And, and maybe not that appetizing. I'll admit when I first heard about this, it didn't sound all that appetizing to me. Wow, but what's life without a little adventure? We quickly found out it's a meal we can watch being prepared over and over, and it's pretty darn good too. Pat, you are one of the people like me, and I'm glad it was so, such an honor to meet you because I have heard of fish boil, but it's never sounded very good, and you felt that way as well, right? Well, when I first moved here, I saw a sign that said fish boil, and I said, what in the world are they talking about? <laughs> until I got invited to one and I tried it and I was like, oh, now I see, it's really good. So what exactly is a fish boil? First up, a hot fire is key. Next, the potatoes. And just a pinch of salt. And when those things are about done, it's time for the fish. I'm up cooking approximately 117 pieces of white fish. Uh, they're all caught on Lake Michigan. Then stand back. Six. Because it's time five, for a show. Four. Three. Whoa. I think it's the show. You know, everybody loves standing around a big fire outside. I think it's the history and tradition of it. The fact that this is something that goes back to the, you know, the early settlers of Door County. And within minutes, from pot to plate, it's time to eat. More than just a dinner, it's an experience that takes you back to another time. That's the magic of this place. You can come down this little end street here, this little dead end street, mm -hmm. and you can kind of leave the world behind. Now, folks, in the warmer months, the White Gull Inn, as well as several other Door County restaurants, have fish boils every single night. I'm looking forward to going back. I'm going to bring my wife. We're going to enjoy it. And we have more details on my blog at WTHR.com slash Chuck's Big Adventure. I'm telling you, that was one of the best meals I've ever had. Really? 625, it was boiled. 640, all 40 people in the restaurant were served that quickly. Well, just down the street from the White Gull is another historic inn and restaurant, the Whistling Swan. And it's the oldest operating inn on the Door Peninsula. It was actually moved across a frozen green bay to its current location in 1907. Wow. And today they offer unique accommodations and a delicious farm to table menu. That was my meal right there. Stay with us. In our next half hour, we are headed to the National Mustard Museum, <laughs> and I cannot wait to share this story with you. If you can wait a little late to go to work so you can watch it, do it. Very much worth it. <laughs> this has been such a fun week with these. It, it has been fun, and I want to thank uh, our producer, Megan Simpson, and of course, the greatest photographer and editor in the world, Steve Rhodes, for their uh, incredible work on well, all this. You know,